and welcome to our info session on the American Language Program. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about our program and what might be a good fit for you as you're thinking about ways you can improve your English and study in New York. My name is Jana Quigley and I'm the Assistant Director of ALP Student Life and today I'm joined by our director Mary Pickett and we'd love to share with you what we believe makes our program special and I'm going to hand it over to Mary to get us started and tell you a little bit more about our program. Hi everyone, as Jana says my name is Mary Pickett and I'm the director of the American Language Program. So uh, just a little introduction uh, to the ALP. Um, the ALP has been on campus at Columbia for over 100 years, and we are one of only two Ivy League intensive English programs. So if you're interested in studying English at an Ivy League university, we are a great choice. Um, we have a very experienced faculty who've been teaching for many years, uh, and we have a rigorous academic program uh, with clear objectives that really help you reach your English language goals. And we think that we offer a really unique educational and cultural experience because we are an Ivy League program and we're right here in Columbia, uh, right in the city of New York. So what is it like to be a student in our program? Um, our intensive English program, uh, we, we teach integrated skills. So that means that you don't have a reading class or a writing class or a speaking class. You teach all of those all together with grammar, pronunciation and vocabulary as well. Uh, and you actively use your English in class. You're going to speak a lot and participate often. Uh, you'll learn English around themes. So we think it's important to learn English in context. So you'll look at different topics and, and issues and use authentic materials to explore English. And then you'll, you'll speak about them and write about them as well. And then you also learn about US culture. It's really important to, to, to learn about the culture of the language that you're, that you're learning. And here in New York, uh, you'll, you'll learn not just about American culture, but also other cultures too. It's a real multicultural experience. And then the other important thing is that we teach you to think critically. You'll, you'll ask questions, you'll, you'll think about things in new ways and, and question the material that you're looking at, which also helps you prepare for, for a US university experience. We have eight levels uh, of, uh, of English in our program from pre-intermediate to very high advanced. We, we don't teach beginners in our program, so you have to come uh, knowing how to speak some basic English. So by the time you reach uh, ALP level six, you're at what we call B2 level in the Common European Framework of Reference, if you're familiar with that scale, uh, and probably scoring around a 72 in the TOEFL. Um, you're ready for university, but, but not what we would say top university ready. Um, that would be reaching our ALP level eight or nine, which is C1, C2, CEFR level, and around 95 or above on the TOEFL. Um, and at that level, you're really uh, ready to compete with the, the best of the best at university. Um, we, we, we do teach academic English. Um, that doesn't mean that if you're not interested in going to university, that it's not useful for you. A lot of the skills that you will learn uh, are transferable to different, to different um, areas. Um, so in addition to essays, you'll also learn uh, how to make presentations um, and you'll learn academic skills like note taking, how to read quickly, how to participate effectively in discussions. And then you'll also learn what it's like to be a student in the US. You'll learn what it's like to be in an American classroom. So um, we offer in our classes a lot of feedback on uh, and error correction on your written and spoken English. You can't learn a language without making mistakes. And so when you, uh, when you speak and when you write, your teachers will give you a lot of, uh, of support and feedback to help you improve. We also have a, a really collaborative and supportive learning environment. Um, it's a, a little family that we build and the more comfortable you feel in class, the, 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 the more you will, you will take risks and, and experiment with your language. We also have a very serious program um, and we take learning seriously. We want students in class and we want students to learn. 
We also have quite small classes. The average is eight to 12. We do have a maximum of 16, but we rarely reach that. And it's a real New York and Columbia experience. You're here on campus, you're here in New York City, uh, and, and we really make the most of both of those things. Um, and I said earlier, it's like, a, it's like a family. Community is really, really important for us. Um, students are coming from all over the world to study English. And it, you know, you're away from home, and what we try to do is to, to, to build a community so that you feel secure and happy and, and that you make friends and, and you learn. So uh, here's a, just a, a note about our faculty. We have 11 full-time faculty um, and depending on the time of year, between 15 and 25 part-time faculty. All of them have a minimum of a master's degree um, or a doctorate in teaching English to speakers of other languages. Um, or applied linguistics. They're very experienced, they write textbooks, they speak at conferences, and they're really leaders in the field of English language teaching. So we, we have different courses that we, that we run the, the, throughout the year. The one that is perhaps um, most famous is our intensive class. Um, we're teaching right now 100% on campus, no online classes. Um, and you can study all year in spring and fall and then in the summer, shorter uh, sessions. And they're, in, they're intensive with me 18 hours a week um, and you have two or three instructors per class. And then in summer, we, we have a couple of extra options. So you can study in summer our advanced academic preparation course. This is also intensive uh, and it's designed for students who are getting ready to start university in the US, either undergraduate or graduate level. It's an advanced level class, level seven plus. And then also in summer, we have our English for Professional Purposes business course. This is a three week course, um, which is focused on business English uh, and kind of business content. It's for business professionals, but a lot of students take it who are getting ready to start their, their master's in business administration, um, often at Columbia, but in other schools too. Uh, again, it's an intensive course, um, but only three weeks long. And then uh, in January, before the spring semester starts, we also have a winter cultural program. This is a two week New York and, uh, and English experience. Um, it's not intensive, so it's 15 hours of class, but on top of that, you also have 12 hours of field trips and excursions in New York City with your instructors. So you kind of get to learn about New York City and improve your English at the same time. And the great thing about this course is that um, you can come in on a tourist visa, you don't have to apply for a student visa. And then uh, if you're not able to get to New York, we do have a semi-intensive program. Uh, this is our online course. You can join from anywhere in the world. Uh, we have courses in spring, fall and summer. In spring and fall they're seven weeks and in summer they're four weeks uh, and that's 12 hours of class a week um, and then you also have some extra time to to talk with your instructors each week as well. So those that's a, a snapshot of the courses that we have available. Um, Jana, can you maybe describe a little bit about who our students are and where they come from? Yes. So what we really love about our program is the diverse and the diverse backgrounds of all of our students. So the ALP is open to anyone over the age of 17 who, like Mary said, already has some knowledge of English and can speak some English. Uh, we have all different ages. We have students ranging from just finished high school to over the age of 70. So we welcome all learners of English. So most of our students have academic plans in the US, meaning they would like to get their master's degree or their undergraduate degree in the future. And so they're using our program as a way to really study and prepare and improve their English. But this is not everybody. Uh, some people are coming just for their own personal benefit. They're coming uh, for their employment. And right now, uh, our top countries that we're seeing are places like China, Saudi Arabia, South Korea, and Japan. But we get students from all over the world, and that's what builds our community and makes us a strong, uh, diverse, welcoming environment. So let me tell you a little bit about what some of our students say about our program. Um, I wanted to tell you about Rawan from Saudi Arabia. 
Uh, she says, as an international law student, studying at the ALP gave me many benefits besides learning English. It helped me to develop and acquire many skills like critical thinking, analyzing, and problem solving. So what you'll find in our program is not just learning the grammar, not just learning uh, the technical skills in English, but really being a student that can critically think through issues, that can talk about controversial topics. Um, that's what we value. And Roberta in Brazil says, I like studying at the ALP because I learn English with great teachers and meet people with different customs and cultures. I have cultivated many friendships in the ALP. These moments are special and I keep them in my memory and heart. And as we've been saying in this info session, community is very important to us. And we hope that you will make friends, be part of the Columbia community, and feel like this is your home. And then Yoshiaki from Japan joined us online for our semi-intensive program. And he says, Columbia University's ALP is the world's best academic English course. It is truly wonderful to be able to study this course online with friends, having the same purpose all over the world in a relaxed environment at home. And so if you can't get to New York, we want to bring Columbia to you and build that same community and that same rigorous, serious study to help you improve your English. One thing that we do because we are in New York City is we make New York City part of our classroom. So you'll see in some of these photos I want to share with you how we use the city to build our curriculum. So we have students travel to the museum and take tours around the city. We uh, we get on the train and we go upstate and we visit all kinds of historic places and landmarks. We are able to uh, study the architecture and uh, really appreciate the history of the city. We go to the parks and, and you'll experience four seasons in New York, summer, winter, fall, and spring. And then we, we also take social trips. We like to uh, go around together and have fun. And so that's one thing about our program. We have a student life component. And so outside of the class, we go on trips around the city. Columbia basketball games and different sports, you'll find a very active student life environment on campus. And Times Square, of course, that's the first place everybody likes to go. We, we make trips to Times Square and of course, Yankees baseball games. So you'll find something that interests you, you know, whatever you would like to experience in the city, New York has it. And so we want to make sure that we uh, really spend time around the city while our students are here. So since we're all on campus, 100% on campus for a lot of our programs, um, you'll have access as a Columbia student to the resources around campus. And a very big component of the campus is the Columbia library system. I would encourage all of our students to take advantage of the Columbia libraries. There are 22 around campus and it's a great way to join the Columbia community, be motivated to study. Um, there are also student clubs in the fall and spring that our students can join. So different interests, different uh, sports, different political topics, ways for you to get involved with not just other ALP students, but the larger Columbia community. We also have a language exchange program that partners an ALP student with a Columbia student who's, who's learning your first language. And there are many ways to join Columbia events on campus or virtually, and you can join different conferences, lectures. There are so many ways to get involved, whether you're here on campus or you are remote, and we hope that you'll find ways to do that. Okay, so uh, applying is very easy. Um, everything is done online. Uh, we only take online applications. And so you just go to our website and in the top left, there is the apply now button. 
uh, and you log on, you create an account, and you can pay your application fee and a tuition deposit. And then we send you a link to take an online placement test. And as long as you meet the minimum level of level two, then every student is accepted. Um, for our in-person classes, so that's the intensive and our summer um, advanced academic prep uh, and uh, business class, um, you do need to apply for an I-20 uh, so that you can get your student visa. And we recommend doing that as early as possible because it can take quite a long time. Um, an absolute minimum of four weeks. And right now, because of, because of getting visa appointments, we recommend doing it uh, really earlier than that. Um, and then for the winter and the semi-intensive, obviously no F1 visa or I-20 is needed. So the application process is a little faster. Jana, do you want to talk a little bit about, um, about housing? Sure. So, uh, one big thing uh, worth mentioning right now is usually the ALP does offer dormitory housing, and this would be a shared room near campus. You're able to walk to get to your classes. Right now, however, because of COVID-19, housing is limited to undergraduates, and so ALP students cannot live in the dorms um, as part of Columbia. However, there are a lot of off-campus Columbia options. So we encourage you just to visit the housing page on our website. You click on student resources, you'll be able to find more information and recommendations for the neighborhood and the city. Great, thank you. Can you speak a little bit about the medical requirements as well? Sure. So this might be on your mind. You know, what are the requirements to be a student on campus at Columbia right now? Um, Columbia requires the COVID-19 vaccine. So most of the people in our community, um, they've been working on that so we can all be back in person. So all full-time Columbia students must also have Columbia University medical insurance. We would be happy to talk more with you about this and what that means. Um, the basics that you need to know now are that intensive students are automatically enrolled in the basic health plan. And what this does is it helps you with hospital emergencies and the costs that come with that or visits to special doctors. And so all students, here's another thing, all students, including our online students, will also pay a health and related services fee. And this would cover access to our Columbia Health Services. This would be counseling, disability services. We have medical services on campus. So this gives you the resources you need while you're a student with us. Okay, so this just gives you a real uh, uh, overview of the, the ALP year. So we have courses pretty much running from January through December, um, from the short winter course uh, through our spring intensive and semi-intensive, and then our various summer courses, um, and then advanced academic preparation and business, summer semi-intensive, semi uh, and then fall intensive and semi-intensive. So we have something going on all year, uh, this gives you also an idea of the costs, um, but the full information about tuition and fees and also dates for all of our courses uh, are on the ALP website. So here's a, a link uh, to the ALP website, the URL, uh, and also um, two important email addresses, uh, the general program uh, email address alp at columbia.edu, and then sometimes uh, Prospective students will also have questions about visa, and so you can also e email alpvisa at Columbia EDU to get information about that as well. Well, we do hope to welcome you soon. We hope that this information helps you as you prepare. We're happy to answer any questions you have. Just send us an email. We are here to support you in your academic journey. So thanks for taking the time to watch this today, and good luck. Good luck. Bye.